What's up, Digidestins? Did you hear the bell? That means it's another day in the Digimon Market Watch. We got a lot of cards to cover. Some very valuable cards actually have moved over some time, and it's just good to talk about everything. So without further ado, let's dive in the video and talk about it. First off, we have our Omnimon Serial Number Battle of Omni BTO5. Somebody's trying to get a 5,000 fat one. Either show me a picture of what number it is before I drop $5,000 on this card. You know it needs to be number one for me to be willing to drop anywhere close to this digits. Yeah. Don't let don't let this be fooled. You either get a picture or it's not worth it. Your upside, though, there's four listings. We got a 91, a 119. DM me for offers. DM me for offer. No, no number. DM me offers sealed unknown number. I don't like the unknown numbers. That's such a gamble. Just tell us the number. You'll guarantee your money and value. I think keeping it at that realistic, 91 is not worth it. If it was 69, maybe the the 3,000 you want. But until I get a value like that, not worth it. Quartzmon across time, people are cooling off on it, but it is being still searched up as a good option. The card is really strong. It can shut down games by itself and being able to trash security, lock down tamers. The setcon matchup is sometimes one of your hardest matchups. Quartzmon allows you to have access to that win game. I think there's a lot of potential. We can see that we could win with this. I think it has the right where we want it to be. Horsebond alternate art though across time showing some bump movement. We're up to $40 a pop, eight listings left. Horsebond is always going to be good in any format until it's restricted or even just banned. But I don't expect this card to be. It's a fair ish card you can out, you just spend time outing it. Europe side looking like 15 euros to 20 euros. I mean, hey, it's it's quartz bond though. Then we have Europe side looking like 30 euros to 42 euros. Okay, you guys are kind of matching us. Alphamon versus Royal Knights. You guys are searching this up as well. It's been bought a few times actually in the last couple days. Maybe people are getting into the Royal Knight hype just because it did top a recent event. Made top 16, not getting like first, but Alphamon has potential here. We're looking at threes threes yeah if you guys have been sitting on alpha mod might be a good time to start listing them and just getting them to move this thing was like a dollar one euro to two euros to three euros is kind of where we're sitting at as well alpha mod double diamond is also getting bought too and showing some movement as well i don't fully know why if you guys know when the reasons behind this is a valid one we'll bring it up for the next video but looking at it for one dollar and fifty cents like 90 cents there isn't really anything to be out of the ordinary here but alphamon double diamond secret is starting to show some movement trend on your upside though wow explosive trend here one euro two euros good to see then we have black war graymon alternate art you guys are searching up black war graymon as well on tcg player nothing too crazy movement we had a sale of like two alternate arts or closer to $18. But outside of that, nothing too crazy. Then Europe side, 28 euros to 30 euros. Good luck with this. Black War Greymon Tamer Party Pack. It's getting bought. I don't understand that. I mean, I think this is just for collective purposes, but yeah, $3 a pop, plenty of listings. People are paying for it. I don't know why though. I would have bought it at a dollar, but it's going up. Europe side, 95 cents, 99 cents, one euro to two euros. No reason for this thing to be moving. Black War Greymon Alternar from Release Special Boosters. Somebody's thinking of Copium or something like that. This thing was showing some decent movement earlier last month. Now it's kind of just tapered off. Whatever spice anybody's thinking of, it's going to be quite interesting. Europe side looking like 10 euros to 15 euros to 18 euros. Gabumon Starter Deck 16, Wolf of Friendship Starter Deck 16. Showing some bump movement. This was because of the new Maimon top and... I just waited out at this point. There's no reason to really be rushing for this. It's a $2 card. It's a rare, nothing too scary here. Europe side looking like three euros, four euros. Same thing, the Numemon deck, purple Numeme base showed something. Shine Greymon Ruin Mode alternate art, alternate being booster EX04, looking like $75 and climbing. So this is just a regular one. And yeah, there's only seven listings left. This card is just going to always be low stock. Europe side looking like 77 euros, 80 euros, 90 euros. Good luck with this. Gallimon versus Royal Knights BT13 showing some movement as well as people just thinking of some spiciness to go with it. I mean, it's not a bad take. Gallimon is very much a game closer in its own right. I was thinking of maybe teching this somewhere, but we'll see. Europe side alternate art versus Royal Knight BT13 going up. 
we're looking like eight euros nine euro like no not eight euros 80 euro eighty dollars eighty five dollars eighty four dollars the europe side looking like 23s 28s let's go over let's see for the ulti 74 80 good luck with this magnamon x antibody x record bto9 11 dollars and 23 cents and climbing i'm not surprised here people are coping on this this thing should tank once we get the new x antibody this thing gets yeeted out fast it's not even funny i, I don't see any point in wasting money on this card europe side looking like seven euros eight euros to nine euros not worth it analog youth classic collection ex01 bump it up just a little bit again five dollars a pop like I said, if you can get your hands on Classic Collection, you buy a box at the $20, $30 mark. You make about $10 profit easily off of this. But yeah. Europe side, though, looking like one euro 40 cents, two euros 70 cents, three euros. Do not buy this box or you guys just buy the single. Zubamon promo, limited promo edition. We're sitting at $20 a pop again. This card just does not want to go stay low. But that's all in all we have to talk about here. Just hype for Raggy Boy, and that's about it. Rag Ragnar Lord didn't do as well, but you know what? I think Ben Ben Ben's style of play and always having this card in there is always a benefit. As I played against him numerous times, and he's and since this card was created, he's always had it in the list. Yeah, I'm kind of happy for the Zuba. Zuba being $20, I'm not too thrilled at. It's maybe a two of, not a full play set of. But yeah, if you guys want to check out anything Ragnar Lord related, check out Ben Ben. He does a lot with Ragnar. Europe side looking like 13s to 18s to 20 euros. Venus Mon Cross Encounter BT10 bumping up to $13, $13. Oof, have it, flip it. Europe side looking like 7.50, 8 euros, 8 euro 50 cents. Take these off the market, go to Facebook Marketplace and just plop them there and see if anybody would pick them up for at least a two dollar hike pegasus mon x record purely stamp what happened when did this happen we're now a 25 dollar to 45 to 60 dollar card what did this europe side looking like 50 cents 50 cents 70 cents then you have heavy leomon animal coliseum ex05 we are looking like a bump here this was just hype because there was a leomon top in the vortex regional or the latinum regional one of the two they had a top and it wasn't a bad list it was actually pretty solid europe side looking like 10 euros to 12 euros and on buyout status almost this is crazy there's not many listings death x alternate x record bto9 95 dollars and climbing it just answers the meta very cleanly it it's just death x just that rookie rush shenanigans or anybody playing high tamer counts just answers europe side looking like 62 65 70 you guys could easily probably convert over to us and make it a little bit but up to you apocalymon alternate art exceeds apocalypse apocalymon let's take a look at this 13 dollars a pop is not a bad pickup i mean yeah snag them when you can snag them i mean if you guys really this dude's i know somebody's gonna buy each and every one of these 13 dollar copies trigger the buyout again and just be like that just expect this thing to just keep going up and down I, I know the player. Europe side looking like 12 euros, 13 euros, 15 euros. Metal Gurumon Ace Alternate Art, starter deck 16, $700. 1,000. I mean, last one was sold back on 324. Damage foiled, by the way, for 250. What in the name of God was that? Europe side looking like 300 euros, 340 euros. The card's never going to come down. I'm sorry to say. It's just a hard pull. Jessmon GX Alternate Art Cross Encounter BT10 bumping up as well a little bit. Some sales for $54, but nothing too crazy out of the ordinary since then. I mean, yeah. Europe side looking like 20 euros, 30 euros, 41 euros, 42 euros, bumping up a little bit. Agumon starter deck, Dragon of Courage. We're showing a little bit down climb, $2 basically. Nothing too crazy. Europe side looking like 1 euro 99 cents, 2 euros, 2 euros 57 cents, 3 euros, and not many listings either crazy revelation of lights previously stamp we're looking at 12 dollars and climbing people are hyping it up i knew this was going to eventually happen and i warned you guys a while ago about it when it was like in the five dollar range now we're we got back down to eight but yeah setcon's now starting to use this and it's getting scary europe side looking like four euros 50 cents six euros guys come over to the facebook marketplaces make some money there emissary of hope blast ace pre-release cards we're looking like a 20 dollar card good luck on getting anything for this cheap anymore europe side looking like six euros 10 euros if you guys want to make some money get over to the market book crimson blaze 2023 store participation new awakening bto8 bumping up too we're looking at 12 dollars a pop 
for the last solds but we're at a 25 dollars buyout oh my goodness europe side looking like three euros 20 cents four euros 50 cents six euros crimson blaze 2023 store participation new awakening bt08 bumping up again too we're looking at 23s 24s top four crazy europe side looking like three euros and 50 cents five euros you guys are not even touching this that's crazy flaremont regional participation 16 dollars and climbing should have bought them when they were eights that was me i mean i have two parts the regionals i'm gonna be playing in but we'll see what happens there three to four euros ten euros should come down crest crescent mon you know, $16 and climbing as well. I'm just going to wait for this to drop. Europe side looking like 4 euros, 10 euros, 14 euros. Good luck with this. Cargo German, regional participation, Blast Ace going down. We've got 17, 17s. I'll, I'll wait for it to drop. Europe side looking like 3 euros, 4 euros, 7 euros. Come my way, please. I'll pay that price. I want to pay the price. But that is for the market watch, though. You know, Serialize and Omni is just being ridiculous. But I want to ask this a reminder that tomorrow I will be live streaming my run of the regionals that I play in. But yeah, we're going to be doing what you guys picked for the deck for me to play. And I'm excited. Hopefully we get a serialized Omni and hopefully it is a good one. But without further ado, guys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll catch you next one. Peace.